what is up guys I'm back with a new video and today I'll be reacting to I have 10 kids at age 18 I have a special guest say hello hello my dude okay, so let's get right into it hey I'm Flavia and I grew up in a small and boring town in the US I hated everything about my life except my boyfriend he was pretty cute but then the unimaginable happened I got pregnant at 14, and trust me, it was a big deal in our sm That's how, weird. How does that happen? I, I, that, that, I don't know how that happens, but... You know, I don't... Uh, okay. ...small town. Many parents told their kids to stop being my friend because according to them, I was a bad influence. But I didn't mind. I loved walking through the streets with my big belly at age 14 and everyone staring at me. But once the baby was born, no one cared about me anymore. And I missed feeling special. So I got pregnant again. I simply- How? Why? Why would you want to do that? I want to like, how is this even humanly possible? I don't know. I forgot to Ask tell her. my boyfriend that I had come off the pill. And that time, it was even better because I was expecting twins, even though I was only 15 years old. You must wonder what my parents were thinking throughout all this. Well, they were already in their 60s and retired. They had nothing to do with their lives. So they really enjoyed having grandkids to look after. The only person who wasn't happy was my boyfriend. He said I had tricked him into getting me pregnant twice. His parents also hated me. They said I had ruined their son's future. But my boyfriend has always been a good dad, and I know he likes kids, because when he got me pregnant a third time when I was 16, he really shouldn't have been surprised. And it turns out that I'm one of- What, is she gonna have like six, what, is she gonna have like six trillion twins or something? Like what? Oh, uh, those why? women who has a why high chance of having twins. Mm -hmm. So the third time I got pregnant, I got twins again. So we had five kids in total. I know that most mothers say that being pregnant is hard, but it was easy for me. I love the feeling of having a baby inside my belly. Long story short, I- How do you like that? And they said it's painful to have a baby in your stomach. I mean, like, that is true, but- I wonder, wait, I wonder why they don't give anesthesia to people that are pregnant they are about to get their baby. I don't know. I don't know. I got pregnant again at 16 with twins, then another time at 17 with triplets, and one last time with twins at 18. That means that today, as an 18-year-old, I have 10 kids. I seriously don't recommend this to anyone. I've had- How do you get 10 kids? Like- I don't know. He keeps on getting so pregnant. I'm just a voodoo magic crap. I had to sacrifice everything for my kids including my education, and even my good looks. I mean, I'm only 18. You don't look at it at all. You look like a six-year-old. Sure, sure, sure. I said six-year-old, not six, if you guys are six guys. I'm like a six-year-old. She does look like a six-year-old with that hair. But I yeah. already look like I'm 35. It's because it's... I mean, she's not wrong. So no. stressful to take care of so many kids. Kids. And Oh. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. That's seven kids, you liar. My hips have gotten much wider. And my belly is covered in stretch marks and is all saggy, even though I'm not even pregnant right now. I was so insecure about my body that I even asked my boyfriend if he still found me attractive. Luckily, he is a good guy and told me I still looked as stunning as when we'd first met. So, we are. Wait, one, two, one. three, four. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's nine. Wait, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, you skipped six. One, two, the, there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, this is why I don't educate you. I don't know how to count stars. <laughs> we are a good family, with the exception of my firstborn child. He is a monster, and we can't leave him alone with his siblings because he's super violent and enjoys hurting them. 
I know this is scary. That's me though. That's me though. Present True. in psychopaths. You might think I'm evil for saying this, but sometimes I wish that he would just disappear. He only cares about himself, and he's ruining all of our lives. But at least my other kids are great. They are cute and love to play with each other. You're telling me that's playing? Kids, that? kids, kids just about to die. It, it, these look like they're praying. Yeah, true. What the heck is going on? Wait. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now I'm raising my kids with my mom and dad, while my boyfriend focuses on school, so he can someday make enough money to support a large family like ours. We also decided to not have any more kids for the next few years, because it would just get too expensive. Some of my kids even call their grandma mom, but I don't mind. Actually, something crazy happened one month ago. Two men broke into our house. Why do they walk like it that? happened at they just built different. <laughs> what is it? But how they what? build like that? Look at that. They broke their leg. Sure, sure, sure. How, uh, look at their face. Like, what is that mouth? That's an oo woo mouth. That night while I was asleep, but my three-year-old boy, Chris, noticed them and ran to my bed saying, There's someone downstairs. I thought he had been dreaming, but then I heard some noises and I knew he was telling the truth. Luckily, my boyfriend was staying over that night, so I woke him up and we decided to call the police instead of confronting the thieves. We didn't want to risk it, hey, in case- You tell him you're scared of two robbers, and you're like a, a 14 family, cause them and the grandpa and grandma and plus the 10 children? It's Yo, you can jump- You can jump them! You literally like seven times as many people as they are. <laughs> like, what the heck? You scared of them? Just they jump them. Our kids. Especially the evil one. Yeah. No, that one can take them on by himself. I was terrified. Yeah, just punches. But after ten minutes, the police arrived, and they were able to catch. Why did they walk like that? Catch the thieves. They just built it. Different. So you see, having children also has its. Is this Darman now? I. Yeah, I guess this is Darman. So you just hope that so once they go to school, they protect each other, so that none of them will be picked on. And soon, we will be able to do fun What is that? Wait, is he a snowman? Yeah. One of their brothers is turning to snowman. Holy crap. Stuff like snowball fights and singing Christmas songs together. But there's another problem. My boyfriend's parents are trying to get- Wait, did I just see Dream in the background? Yo, it's Dream! And it's also Nezuko. It's Dream as a girl and um, I don't even know, anime, I think. Yeah. Nezuko! That's Nezuko from Demon Slayer. I don't watch anime. Whatever. But, uh, okay. Let's rip off Dream. They're trying to Let's convince rip off him Nezuko. to leave our city to study at a good college. But, of course, I hate that idea. There will be so many pretty girls, and I am scared. But why do you, why do they walk like that, bro? I don't know. You just built the fence. He walks different. Heard that he will fall in love with one of them and leave me. Recently, one of his high school classmates, Joanna, asked him out on a date, even though she knew my boyfriend and I were in a relationship and had ten kids. I mean, everyone in our small town knows. I Does the school just have like a window to their house or something? True. It's open. The 18 year old teenagers with 10 kids? But I'm lucky to have such a loyal boyfriend because he rejected her and told me about it afterwards. When I heard that Joanna had hit on him, I got so angry. I wrote a. Th this is Facebook? I don't think it is. It looks, think like, it's a, it looks like a super old version of Reddit. True. <laughs> Facebook post calling her out for trying to steal my boyfriend. A lot of people liked my post because most people already knew what kind of girl Joanna is. Not a good one. She responded to my post, saying that none of it was true. But over the next few weeks, she tried a couple more times to steal my boyfriend at school. It's so pathetic. Just but stop already. the least of my problems. 
the real problem is that there aren't any good jobs in our small... Okay, now I'm wondering, what does this have to do anything with the title? Like, at the beginning, I... it had something to do with the title, but now it's just... What? <laughs> what is happening right now? I don't know. Town. Which means that at some the point, plot. my boyfriend will need to move to a bigger city anyway to find a good job. That's the only possible way to support such a big family. But there's no way we can afford rent in a big city with so many kids. So we won't be able to go with him. But I guess I should stop complaining. I'm lucky to have a boyfriend who does his best to take care of his children. Many fathers in this kind of situation would probably run away and start a new life. At least he's not like that. Okay. <laughs> we end off with the ad. But for, with for Mora 9. A video editor for all yeah. creators. But that, the end was like, it didn't make sense with the title at all. Yeah. And then, whatever. I guess it's gonna end it up. I'm just gonna end it for today's video. Before the video, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, turn notified when I make a brand new video. Like the video, and yeah, see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.